I'm going to show you how I made my code better and more efficient. Let's get started. So first off, two quick things. One, I know this is a smaller project than you might be used to, but I put so much time and effort into my last video, the Halloween special, that I was really tired and kind of burned out. But don't worry, next video will be back to normal. And second is I won't be making a case for the project. Normally, I do really finish projects, but I started this as kind of like a coding challenge, a fun way for me to improve um, on my coding skills. So I thought if I don't make a case for this, I can still use the parts for more interesting, more exciting projects than this. I didn't change anything about the setup, so let's quickly skip to the loop. I made a few changes to how the program works, so it accepts a wider range of responses, while at the same time being easier to read and shorter. Here you can see I used a really handy function I didn't know existed, to lower case. It's pretty self-explanatory, but what it does is it makes all the characters in SMS string lowercase. That way, lowercase or higher case message doesn't matter. Then I used another function I didn't know existed, trim. This deletes all the spaces in the message, so that doesn't matter either. Another thing I changed was the way it detects if the message is water 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. Before, it worked like this. If water 0, then, else, if water 1, then, else, if water 2, then, etc. You get it, it was very, very repetitive. Now I just tell it to get the seventh character in the message, then, if possible, turn that into an integer and use that integer for the switch. I also changed the way it calculates how much to water the plant. So in a message I tell it to send 50 times the number in the message from the user. I calculated how much time it took to pump exactly 50 milliliters and told it to wait that long, times the number in the message from the user. There are probably still a lot of things on which I could improve. And if you have any tips or tricks or anything, you can post them in the comments, I'd love to hear them. As I said before, this video is pretty short. Luckily, next video will be back to normal. Also, if you haven't seen it yet, be sure to go watch my Halloween special. If you liked the video, like and consider subscribing, I'd really appreciate it.